Okay, so let's look at the comma. The comma, comma. So used to list items of things. So I have tea, bread, tea, comma, bread and milk. So tea, but we use an and before the last and the second last thing. So if I say I have a pen, I have pen, whiteboard, suspenders, glasses, camera, eraser, and, and magnet, and magnet. But before all of them, we say, we use a comma, pen, comma, camera, comma, whiteboard, comma, camera, comma, tripod, comma, suspenders, comma, glasses, comma, and, Eraser. Eraser. How cool is that? So we use a comma to space things out in a list. We should bring coffee, comma, butter, and chocolate. Coffee, comma, butter, comma, pen, comma, bread, comma, milk, comma, tea, and chocolate. Makes sense. So, we use a comma after an adverbial word to describe or introduce a sentence. So we could say, ultimately, comma, dot, dot, dot. Ultimately, this class will be done. Therefore, comma, dot, 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 I will keep working now. Therefore, I'll keep recording. Likewise, comma, Likewise, comma, dot, 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 I have more classes to record, more classes to plan. Hmm. Therefore, I will achieve my goal. How cool is that? So, we can replace brackets, just brackets, brackets, to expand or explain something. To expand or explain. Explain and talk about things what they mean, what they mean. So we could say, London, comma, which is a very old city, comma. So like we're saying, London, and opening a comma, and we're talking about it, just, just to add some more information, to explain something which might be relevant or important or referenced again later on. So London, comma, which is a very old city, comma again, to close like a bracket, we open the brackets and close the brackets. London, which is a very old city, comma, has a lot of people, a lot of streets, a lot of history, has other things. Mm -hmm. Rome, which was founded in 753 BC, was, has, is, something else was Rome which was founded in 753 BC was the biggest city in the world at one point has a lot of Roman ancient Roman architecture is is the oldest city in Italy for example yeah how cool is that so by, creating, by using a comma, we can introduce a sentence that explains or expands something, and then another comma to close that sentence, and then continue with the point we're making. Rome is the oldest city in Italy. Rome, which was founded in 753 BC, is the oldest city in Italy. Makes sense. How cool is that, language explorers? Let's keep exploring.